yeah, that fixed it. What is that? What's up, Twitch? Uh, we're gonna stream some like. Hello, robotic monkey. Hello, mock turtle soup. Sorry for the short notice. Uh, I wasn't I wasn't intending on streaming tonight, but then I found myself with nothing to do, so I thought I'd pop on and we'd continue our journey through the lake. Sound good? Fuck it, let's go. Am I using my Yeti mic? I am not using my Yeti mic because um, I don't think you can plug it into the Xbox, which is frustrating. I'm using, um, you, which is annoying because you could on the last one. Um, so that's a bit shit. Uh, but obviously Microsoft are being a bit picky. So I'm using my headphones. Oh, I can't even remember what I was supposed to be doing. All right, here we go. Oh, where am I? All right, so I've got a bunch of letters nearby. So let's go do them. Let's go at the top first. Okay, fine. Let's do that. Good morning, P.O. It's time for a P.O. positive for that key. Okay, folks. Let's okay. see what it is today. The floor is yours, I genuinely Andy. thought Good I was going to knock that down and drive through that's them, but uh, I remember this Return game, there's no like that. that has not been rewinded. I mean, okay. really? Be kind and rewind. Thanks. Let's go out to the top first. Let's go out to the top. How are we doing tonight? What are we saying? Good evening. Didn't you say you didn't like this on the pod? I did, but I also said that I need to stream it and need to play more. I'm not super excited about playing this tonight. I think I've got an idea for another stream. There's another game that I'm definitely going to stream I know that much, but not much of it, you know, maybe a night or two. Uh, where am I again? Alright, okay, I, I need to try that one off first. So let's go do the letters first. What am I pressing? Yeah. I need to turn anyway. Is it this one? No, it didn't mean to do that. How do you get out? Hey. Remember this. Did you watch James Tarts on stream? So it's the most I've laughed in ages. The the only bit that I've seen is when he got raided. And oh my god, if I was Ian I'd be furious. He took what? A hundred a hundred people over? hundred and five people over to watch him? And he said, thanks for the raid, I guess. And then said, this isn't the best time to raid. Or this raid didn't work or something like that. And I was like, mate. At least thank him. What, what, what else funny stuff happened? Because we're recorded twice. So any hints and stuff that I should check out, please let me know. Please let me know. James is the best, that isn't he? He's the absolute best. I love that man so much. You're worried about my neck posture? Oh, well, I wouldn't worry about it. It's been like it for years. My back is fucked. Also, it looks way worse than it is. It looks like I'm doing that. Right, but because the camera's low, I'm actually... My eyesight's not... Actually... Uh, I'm not actually looking up that much. It's just that the camera's fucking low. Hence the fact that you can see my fucking ceiling in, in the uh, in the shot. This is I don't I don't go Matt Murray style. I haven't got my right. I suppose it's, I've got to go into here. Okay, let's park up here properly, shall we? Let's get the parking right. We didn't we didn't manage to master that. Let's see, I can parallel park properly. Let's do that. Yeah, that's alright. That's pretty good. Happy with that. Alright, let's get this out. Oh, the video store again. Okay. 
Which one's this? 351 Main Street. Let's roll. H121. Oh, H1Z1. Isn't that? That's the zombie thing, isn't it? It's a little bit like um, PUBG. Hey, that. Oh, hello again. More mail for me? It's and more mail the tape for you. you gave me. Oh, wow. You watched it already? A drifter in a sleepy town, an affair, and a plot to kill a husband? Oh, is that up loud as well on my telly? Hold on. Yeah, I have the audio on my telly as well. Uh, There's a lot more to this movie than I expected. It's a classic, and probably my favorite noir. You it did a remake a couple years back, way. but it's, well, it's not as good. You can't beat Lana Turner's smoldering intensity. No. That's my sister. Cannot beat it. Yeah, she's great I'm gonna say it. that I liked it. I'm so glad you liked it. Most of the people here don't really appreciate the art of classic cinema. Okay. They just want to see Police Academy again. Ah, uh, who doesn't? <laughs> I'm afraid you're right. Pretty lonely being the only movie buff around. Well, oh, keep feeding my VCR rude. and I'll be up to speed in no time. Will do. Let me think about it and I'll get back to you. See, Angie's you know, all right. Got time it's good to see you. Any particular reason? Because I have a sneaky little plan. Let's kill all of that woman's cats. Oh, we're whispering now? I want you to meet me, say, at, at five today. Okay. Is that the plan? No, but it's where I'll discuss the plan. You in? Yeah, I'm in, I'm in. All I'm right. in. I'm, I'm in. in. Let's go see what's going on. We're going to go and kill that afternoon. woman's cats. Wait, where are we meeting up? Your place. It's 102 New Street, right? Here's the big film, briefly snob. Uh, looking forward to some more unconvincing conversations. There hasn't been a single, single convincing conversation in this game. Invite yourself over, that's quite... Yes. How did you find that out? I yes. didn't even hear what she said. How did you find that out? Looked up your last name in the Rolodex. Okay. Your parents are regular That's... clients. There, there wasn't data protection back here, was it? We're in the 80s, remember that? Yeah, that's really creepy, fierce poodle. I looked I looked up your details. No wonder data protection come in, because that's fucked up. Uh, right, oh, I missed out what... Um, he was determined to open a chest and must have done the same run about 20 to 30 times, each one more frustrating than the last. Did he get to the chest in the end, uh, Captain Fluffkin? Uh, did he get to the chest? Also, feel free to subscribe, share the share the, the Twitch channel, wherever you usually share your Twitch channel. Yeah, GDPR, that's it. Yeah, we got there eventually. Was it worth it, or was it something really shit? Was it like ten souls. <sighs> um, I saw him. I saw a bit where he was taking on that one enemy over and over and over again, I'm getting frustrated with it. That was pretty good. Okay, right. Let's continue. Uh, what am I, oh, she, what did she say? What did she say? What am I answering to? Ah, oh, that's a shame. What did, what did, what did she, what am I answering? Guess, I guess, but can't we just meet up at the dinner? Or do I say, oh, well, what do I say, chat? Come on. Pick an answer for me. No one cares today. No one's no one's caring about this game at all. First answer. Okay, well that's the first one I've seen. So. I guess, but it's settled then. See you at five, partner. 
Okay, partner. I'll see you at five, partner. Da. What's this one? Gremlins. Okay. I'll see you at five, partners. Right, okay, where am I going now? I'm so right at the end of this road. I'm not at the end of the road, but I want to right it. I'll swing it around. Oh, you can't swing it. Have they got a talk radio station on it? You can change radio stations, can't you? Have they got a talk, station, a talk radio station on there? Because that would be good. Pushing out. It's utterly pointless. <coughs> I had an interesting uh, afternoon. It wasn't interesting at all, but we went out for a meal for my nephew's birthday. And for the first time in my life, I complained about the food. I ate maybe a quarter of it and I waited it to the end and the waitress came up to me and said when she just went to collect my plate and I just said I'm really sorry but this is really didn't like this and she said what was wrong with it and I said it's just full of oil and it's completely tasteless and I was just like not shaking but I was pretty like nervous about it because I've never done that before. Have you? Have you ever done that before? I was like pricking it a little bit, and um, uh, as she was really nice about it, she said, "I'll, I'll let the I'll let the um, the chef know," and then I didn't have to pay for it, which was a touch because it was about fourteen quid, and I get no money. Where am I supposed to go? This is the right address, isn't it? 102 Pine. Do I go around the back? This Was this where the mechanic was? Hello? 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 This way? This way? Hello? Oh. I mean, that's just... That's just hanging there, isn't it? Literally no support to that whatsoever. That's just hanging. That got knocked down in no time. Oh my god. I've walked all the way around here and there's no way I'm going back. Oh, that's ridiculous. So I've got to walk all the way back around the building. Is that a bowl of olives? Was it a bowl of olives? No, I don't like olives. I don't like olives. It was a calzone. Which, I don't know if anyone else... Or is it calzone or calzone or whatever. Um, and I don't know if anyone else orders it. But do you also feel like a child for ordering that? Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, I feel like a child when I order that shit. Can I have a pizza turn over, please? Why can't I deliver this parcel? Is this a bug? Is, is someone supposed to be here? Or is it next door? Let me try next door. It's not here, is it? Because the fucking logo is not here. This is 104, and I want 105. Have I got the did I pick up the wrong package? Hold on, let me try again. Let's try again. 102 is what I need. Oh, that's heavier than I thought. And this is 102. So I'll ring at the doorbell. Yeah, I just, I just didn't ring at the doorbell. It is about down point. Alright, I'll leave it on the doorstep. 
I had to complain once about yeah, leave it at the doorstep then. Go on. There you go. Bye mate. Hold on. Uh what are you saying in the chat? Right, dodgy cow zone, yeah, totally. Oh god <laughs> this cow. <laughs> <laughs> Carl Carlos Hick, who's in the chat, was at that mill. Um, four hours we were in there for. Well, we Carl, four hours to have a mill. It was intense. It was intense. How was yours? Was yours alright? <laughs> Dodgy cow zone. Why is it loading? Why has that happened? What? What's going on? Oh, right. Can you just fast travel? Okay, alright. So, where have I got to go? I've got to go. I've got to... Let's do that one first. Wait, you can just fast travel, can you? Place a waypoint. I'm gonna do that again. Okay, alright, whatever. The breadsticks were nice though, weren't they, Carl? That's a nice breadsticks. Actually, my style was nice as well. I had cannelloni. Time for that squid. Seven out of ten for me, Dave. I wish I had to complain now. Yeah, you could have got it for free. Although, did you smash the whole plate? Because you probably wouldn't have got it for free, you'd be there. Right. I was so tired as well. I've been up since six o'clock, and yesterday I was up from four in the morning. Which I probably told you about three times. I'm right, only after 400. Here we go. This game good. Seen it on Xbox Store. Oh yeah. Have you not played it, uh, Notorious Nile? Didn't fancy it. This was a gift actually. Matt Matt Murray bought this for me. Because he wanted me to play it. For some reason. Right. Let's get up. No. Ah. Hello. Hello, Mr. Mackey. I have a few letters for you. What? I'm Meredith Weiss. Yeah, yeah. Meredith Weiss. Thomas Kid. I remember you running around the lake when you were yay high, running around the getting lake. into all sorts of trouble. What can I do you for? Eh, nothing much. I'm the new mail carrier for a bit. I have a few letters for you. I was wondering why you were wearing your dad's get-up. Enjoying yourself so far. Uh, I'm having I'm fun. I'm having yeah. fun, yes. Well, that's good. I'm guessing I'll see you around a lot more, Miss Weiss. For sure, Mr. Mackey. Have a nice day. Yeah, like, yeah, I've had a lot of calzones in my life. And uh, they're usually delicious. And they taste chunky. And the cheese is just, oh. So I was really looking forward to it. But yeah, no, it was burnt on the bottom. The dough was a bit raw. And the chicken was clearly frozen. Or processed, I couldn't work it out. But it was tasteless. It was rank. Shame. Other than that, it was nice seeing everybody. It was a family thing. Um, although Carlos Hickman is not technically family. We've taken him in. We discovered him. And we took him in. And he's grown up to be a, a strong boy. We're all very proud of him. That's time to get this motherfucking package. Just... 
Damn. Open the fucking trap, man. What on earth did these folks order? This box is a pool. Here we go. What? Hi, Maureen. Hi, hon. How are you doing this fine day? Take the mountain chops here. Yeah, they were pretty impressive, weren't they? I'm fine, but how are you and the kitchen? I'm yeah, fine. Because it all but how went are off you? yesterday. You know, with the kitchen exploding. Oh, that? <laughs> Nothing a fresh lick of paint and a mop couldn't fix. Doesn't mean to scare you. <laughs> Honestly, Let's pick up where we um, left off, shall we? Could, God, and one piece of blueberry pie. Dracos, Ashley, God, one blueberry Dracos, pie. Whatever your name is. Uh, Meredith just, Wise, back in Providence. Oh? Frozen. How's life treating you, darling? Uh, well, being back feels a bit strange. It's, it's all right, right, actually. actually. Yeah, it's not too bad. I'm just chilling. I delivered a package to Kay at her house earlier. Yeah, certainly did. she told me. How did that go for you? It was a bit weird seeing again. I think I put my foot in it, to tell you the truth. I think it went okay. I think I put my foot in it, to tell you the truth. I can imagine it can be a lot to take in. Can't remember who Kay was. both of you. Especially after being away for so long. Oh, and that's yes, right. There are... Some things that never change, right? Yep. Not that. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna say it. Uh, no, I don't. Yeah, you being one of them. You being one of them. <laughs> I will take that as a compliment. It was intended but I as well. the diner looks a bit strange to you, doesn't it? No. I like what you did with the place. I'm being I like nice. what you did with the place. I'm being yeah. nice today. I decided it was time for a change. Didn't That's feel the right. same after my stand-up. I mean, that is died. one of the worst World workshops I've turning. ever seen in my life. Gotta keep moving along Table with it, Tabletop, whatever right? you want to call it. It's disgusting. Oh my gosh, Maureen. Stan died? I'm so sorry. I, I had no idea. Thank you, darling. But it's really okay. It's <laughs> I been killed ten him. years already. Ten and a half, almost. Oh, boy, did I love that man. <sighs> We've been married for so long. Look at that table like top. Wouldn't buy that, would you? After a while, I decided that sadness wasn't the only emotion I was allowed to have. That's very true. It's not what Ski Stan would have wanted either. That is very true. Has anyone actually thought, actually, I might do that? Has that crossed anyone's mind? How long does it take to do the test? The HGV test? I bet it's ages, right? It's going to be like months, and then you need to clock up hours or something. <sighs> so, Zai, you're absolutely right. This does feel like an episode of Cory. Nothing is happening. Sounds like you, Sounds went, through like you went through a lot. Thank you, hon. I do appreciate that. Anyway, you have to get back up. So I did. For me but also for Kay. She took her uncle's death pretty hard. I can imagine that. <sighs> Sorry for dumping all that on you like that, darling. Gosh, <laughs> look at your face. I'm a bit surprised you didn't know. Didn't your parents tell you about it? Or Kay? Nope. I can't recall. I can't recall. Uh, it's okay, hon. I honestly don't give a hoot about any blame game. Dead. We all have our lives to live, but okay. Kay's been through a lot. Uh, nursed her uncle through his illness, helping me out. I think seeing you again shook her up a little, is all. She must have missed you during those days. I can imagine. It was good to see her again. I've missed her too. Then, it sounds like you know what to do. Listen, yep. Meredith. Time marches on. Smash my truck directly into her house. It's marching across your face. Life's too short. That's exactly why I decided this place could do with a repurpose after Stan passed. Fresh start. It's been Moe's Diner ever since. And believe it or not, business is better than ever. That's yeah. great to hear, Maureen. Congratulations. She well, killed thank him. you kindly. And listen, you check in with me and Kay again soon, you hear? 
Don't forget about what's important in life. Yeah, murder. Huh, says the woman who forgot my blueberry pie. No, that's just rude. I will return as soon as I have a delivery. That's just rude as well. Hand on my heart, I will return rude. as soon as I have a delivery. Or sooner. Huh? I'll hold you to that. You bet. Bye, Maureen. But imagine not turning up if, you, if you've got a delivery for her. Fuck it. You alright? Look at her eyes. Alright, okay. So great. I mean, it's a crime that you can't play that. Oh, you can! Yeah! Now we're talking. It's blasting time. Some weird input for that. Is. Use my shot wave. Gotcha. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry, I can't look at the chat right now because I'm going up sponge. Whoa! Restarting wave. Did I lose a bike? The, you're not shooting fast enough to use the um What the fuck? They didn't hit me. Okay. Alright. Let's focus now. Stay away from the edges because that's clearly Alright, it didn't touch me, but fine. One burger. Oh, what? What? Peace. Game's broken. Your game's broken. Your game's broken. Who we got here, look? Is everyone just on their own? Oh, but <laughs> they've come together, but they don't want to talk. Okay, well we got on a roll here. Okay, you got two of the same there. Well we got a lot of doubles. And I've got triples of the Nova. And I've got triples of the Roadster. And let's go. Give me HEV form. Uh, I can manage four nights away from oh, yes, yeah, that's the bad side of it, isn't it? Uh, anyone uh, having trouble getting petrol, though? We, we got some this morning. I don't think it's as bad as it was saying, but... Uh, we've got some pet Fucking hell, listen to me. Oh. My boy, twat. Can they want that petrol? See, this is this is just confirmation for everyone that I need Sean, Matt, and James. <laughs> uh, they want that petrol. I genuinely need petrol yet. Have to fear of looking. Like panic button cunt. I, I mean, Ian said it on his show, but don't let him. Don't let him turn it on you. Don't let. Him, don't let him make out like that. It's the public's fault that this is all going wrong. Because um, because it is not our fault. Let's just go and get petrol, and it. Yeah, I think might be right there, ski jump toes. 
but I can assume that that's the only answer. Possible solution to that conundrum. Right, where are we? We are... Where are we? We're there. Oh, right, I can just go out that little... Let's go for a little trip. Yeah! Go deliver this letter. And then we're going to oh. go and find out what the secret is. This is close to where I had my first kiss. Oh, yeah. The A41? I had my first kiss at uh, Earl's. Uh, why am I saying that? Why about that? <laughs> don't worry, like, you don't need to hear that. Look oh, good, the mailbox is in the middle of nowhere. Brilliant. What the fuck? What? Oh, it's this thing. Oh, I've already been here once. Where's the mailbox? There's a face I remember. Good morning, morning Mr. Mr. Harris. Harris. Hey there. More paperwork with my name on it? Well, take a look for yourself. Thanks. Oh, it gets worse every day. Sorry to hear that. Can you believe it? I've been taking care of this lakeside for years. And now they're gonna bulldoze it and build apartments. Wicked. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do that. Sounds like a great place to live, though. That view. If you want a nice view, take a picture. <laughs> Not when a grumpy man is blocking it. <laughs> Say you can file an official objection, but I'm not a great match with bureaucracy. I'd rather get the chainsaw and cut you downtown just, you hall. You just have a look like this. Nothing a chainsaw can't handle. <laughs> just kidding. It's a nice thought, though. Well... Can I help? I'm better with the paper than the chainsaw. <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> yeah, I can get Good it. Good luck with that. Thanks. I'll see if I can come up with something. Okay, you do that. <laughs> you get involved with that. <laughs> Post the fucking that. Oh, I gave it to him, didn't I? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, I gave him the that. I didn't need to post it. I'm gonna scratch his car just so he's got more shit to worry about. Bomb out. Bomb out. Right, let's go home. Wee! Wee! Right, we'll get we'll get back on the road. And then um and then we'll have a chat, shall we? Told my missus there's a cock shortage. Oh come on. Come on. Michael McIntyre in the house. Oh, watch out. Man, you shouldn't panic, listen to him. You should absolutely listen to his show. Watch one of his Twitch streams, man. It's so much fun. And we need to try and... Um, Get his Patreon numbers up. Cause I don't know what I don't know what I'd do without listening to that. If that show ends, I am going to be absolutely gutted. He's the fucking best. Right, that's done for the day. Bam. Bar mate. 
There we go. No, Angie Eastman, you can't really create a woman with a computer. Damn. What movie is that? It's called Weird Science. You really haven't heard of it? It was a pretty big hit. I figured you, with your computer background... All right, I'll, use a computer. I'll add it to the sure. huge mental list I've been compiling ever since we started talking. So that's Weird Science, Life of Python... <laughs> Brian. Brian. Monty Python's Life of Brian. Right. <laughs> you know... You don't really look the part of a computer nerd, either. Uh... Well, I'm off duty Well, for... I'm off duty. For a while. Good for you. So, any particular reason you're not at the nerd factory anymore? It's just uh, I needed to change the series. It's complicated, multiple reasons, I guess. Then we want to talk about it right now. Let's, do Let's just scenery say one. I needed a change of scenery. Okay, well, I totally get wanting something different, anyway. I used to live in Los Angeles. I don't know America well oh, enough really? to, to then, sort of... Oh, um... really? yeah. Providence Oaks is pretty different. <laughs> uh, sure Hughes, is. Uh, Hughes it's Jam, yes, I said it was shit thing. on the last pod. Slower for another. Briefly. But then I've only played a couple of days worth, and this isn't winning me over so far. Yeah, those are two things I like best about it. I didn't listen. Right, yeah. okay, that. Those are the two things I like best about it. Me too, I think. It took some getting used to. So tell me about this plan of yours. Is the suitcase part of it? Oh, right. It's simple. Uh, I want you to distribute movies all over Providence Oaks. I thought it was right. You mean for free? Yeah. You know the town, you're starting to know the people. Not all of them have VCRs yet. <sighs> But that's why God invented movie boxes. And by God, Let me I guess. mean electronics companies. You Look, also have It's a VCR in a box. And it's portable too. So you can take it to anyone. Wow. This is the future of entertainment. She's these I've things, made a right? list of potential customers and the movies I think they'll like. All you have to do is just deliver the movie box with a movie of their choice. Fuck then you go off. and pick it back up once they've watched it. I don't know if I'm even allowed to do that. I mean, I'd be using the truck, which is postal service property. That's right. Um, I'm you do know for the rules. Frank is your boss, right? He's not exactly a stickler for the rules. Oh, no, he's not. Plus, a stickler it's only for the rules. two to start. These are for Lori. You know her, right? The mechanic girl at the gas station, right? The mechanic girl. Yes, good. I have these two for her. The love bug and a nightmare on Elm Street. This one is about murders in a bathtub, right? Well, not exactly. You'll just have to watch it. But not before Lori gets a chance. I think she'll love it. After Lori gives back the box, I have a couple movies planned for Burt Mackey. They are Jaws and The Dirty Dozen. And that's it for now. If you're in, that is. So, you in? Uh, why the fuck not? All right. Same one. These addresses seem to be on my route anyway. I'm in. All right. Even though this is clearly Thanks a bunch, pyramid babe. scheme. Now, do you have any more of this great coffee? Actually, I really need to head back. Oh, what's the rush? I left the store unattended. Better get back. But why are you here? In the... uh, let's do this one. I guess time flies when you're having fun. <laughs> I guess so. Okay. Bye, babe. Hello. Something, something bubbling between these two, is that? Bye, babe. I'll do one more day. I'll do one more day. This is my boss again, isn't it? Hello? Hey, Meredith. Hey, Dad! How's life? I heard something about poker, fishing, and margaritas. <laughs> Talk to Mom, huh? But yeah, can't complain. How about you? Do you like my job? I'm starting to love it. Being on the road, the freedom, Smashing the into houses That's and stuff. That's great to hear. Frank's quite the character, huh? Who's Frank? Frank's quite the character indeed. 
He said you helped him out once. Uh, more than once. Well, what can I say? He likes baseball a bit too much. He plays his well. bet every now and then. Nothing too serious. Uh, uh, which one? I don't even know, even know these people. And what about Bert Mackey? Bert. Uh, Bert doesn't like to talk much, but he's got a heart of gold. Stay on his good side. Speaking okay. of staying on the good side, your mom's telling me to hurry up. Oh yeah. We're going to a movie. Yeah, sure. Okay, a movie. Dad. Don't keep her waiting. What movie? Uh, Stand by me. About four Oregon boys in the fifties. Right up my alley. Sounds good. Say hi to mom for me. Will do. Bye, Meredith. Okay. Work on the audit. Stay on watch TV. Look, you've got to be productive, right? Alright, here we go. Whoa, hold on. The 80s, they didn't have monitors like that, did they? The 80s didn't have monitors like that. Was that a laptop? Shine, P.O. The time has come for a P.O. Positive report. Who's that a laptop? Today's contribution is from Mildred, the senior authority on pets and thieves. It's a positive this time, Jack. My cat, Mortimer, was feeling ill, but thanks to Bert Mackey, he's in great condition again. That's fantastic news, Mildred. Now let's see if I it will keep raining cats involved. and dogs. I'm happy to say it will be dry later on with a bit of sunshine. Did not need to take that cut. Uh, oh no, I just need to get this stuff. You've got a hood, Meredith, use it. Which way we going now? Which way we going? Oh, Alright, let's get rid of these fucking... What am I doing? Why? How am I doing that? Oh. Well, I can just set it to do it. It's fast to do. Okay. Can I just do that? Because that, that means that I can chat to you guys. I don't know. How do, what do I press? I can't see it because my thing's in the way, but can I fast travel or some shit? Okay, whatever, let's just do this. Drive the wrong side of the road, why not? Break. Right, hello mate. Are you getting on any bit with this? Not really, Gary. It's pretty dull, isn't it? Have you played it? Oh, oh I'm looking. Although, to be fair, I'm not following any of the quests or anything. Is they all sound mm. boring. These look like bills. Nosy. Oh, okay, let's go around again. Let's go round again. Baby, what's on back the hands of time? Let's go round again. It does seem very dull. It really does, doesn't it? But should we do it? I mean, are you getting anything out of this stream? What's the time? Oh, come on. Yeah. 
You don't come to see the game. You just come to see me, yeah? I'm sorry about that as well. I mean, I literally asked if you had petrol earlier. Yeah, yeah, it's good. I, I like a bit of Twitch in the evenings. Just having a little chat. Okay, here then. Alright, okay, so it does, it can just fast travel then. Let's do that. Um, not played it, seems a shame because it could be a great idea for a game. Totally, if something happened, if there was a murder or something, then yeah, I'm, I'm bang up for it. Uh, so far, zero murders. Okay. Oh, what is this one? general store is just as Main Street. Okay, well. Main Street. Oh, oh, that's heavier home. than I thought. Why does she... Why do you think literally all the packages that she's delivering are going to be like? What's up? Here's the mail, ma'am. Ugh, one of those yellow parcels. Don't yeah, shoot don't the messenger. Shoot the messenger. <laughs> it's for that thing behind the door, a photography mini lab. They installed it last week and they want me to operate it. Bring this if I don't have away. enough on my chill. plate already. We're going to chill. Support the channel by subscribing. Uh, that's pretty nice, actually. I love photography. It sounds like a headache, sounds indeed. Sounds like a headache, indeed. Some people think they can become professional photographers overnight. <sighs> yeah, Gary. Some people think they could just become professional. What shall I answer, Gary? Yeah, that's a bit annoying. <laughs> yeah. That's a bit annoying. <laughs> they want me to take pictures with the camera and film from this box so I can practice with the Mooney Lab. Uh, on top of running the store. I wish I could help you with that. I love photography. Well, well you here can. you go, and good okay. luck. Take some pictures and then return it to me. Have a okay. nice day, ma'am. Fucking hell, what have I got myself into there? Right, I've got camera at least. Can I zoom in? What's... So I press that to get the camera out. We need some batteries for um, Big Billy Bass. Take it out, pay cash. Rubbish. Right, okay, let's go. Let's look for the worst possible photo we can take. Oh, no, no, it's just getting the motor. Right, where are we going next? <laughs> I think I can totally be a professional photographer. That is... People think they could be a professional photographer overnight. Disgust me. Yeah, disgust me too. Can you take this camera and take photos? Yeah, it sounds fun. I'll just do that. Uh, get a photo of someone being sick. Just start taking the photo of that woman with the, um, with the cats. Here's your mail. Can't talk back to you. It's an inanimate object. Right, where am I going next? I can go here, can I? Do the afters and things. <laughs> I definitely get the shittest photo you can. Okay, I'll do that. Because I bet when I give it back, they go, wow, these are amazing. 
didn't stop. She didn't stop at the stop sign. I believe that is a misdemeanor, isn't it? I love those, uh, those stop signs in America. Oh, I'm so tired. All right, all right, we'll finish this day. Finish this day, we'll finish this stream, and I've got a little bit further. There you go, smash into the diner. No. Yeah. Okay. I didn't bring the package. Oh, I didn't do that. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right, Meredith. Sorry about that. I did not do that. Let's go back to the thing. Hit the car and take the photograph of the evidence. I tell you, I know what I'm going to take her off. Hi, Kay. Delivery for the diner. Hey, Meredith. Sure. Just uh, put it on the counter, would you? Kay, about the other day. What about it? <sighs> I really put my foot in it. Maybe it wasn't the best time for that conversation. Maybe not. Yeah. So... What's going on with your earrings? I talked to Maureen. Let me guess. You got a piece of Maureen's wisdom too, eh? Why oh, doesn't yeah. that surprise me? That explains why she wanted me to take over today's shift, then. She told me about Uncle Stan. I'm so sorry. Thanks. It was a long time ago, but... I appreciate it. It's not the same without him. I'm sorry I wasn't there for you and Maureen. That's kind of you to say, Meredith. I mean, I didn't contact you about it at the time, but then again, I had kind of God, given up by then. Snooze fest. Uh, I guess everyone has their own things to deal with. I was overwhelmed by then. Uh, I guess everyone has their own things to deal with. Even me. I get it. There's always a reason for things to go the way they do. Oh, fucking hell. Even so, it seems like... Thanks for understanding. Thanks for understanding. Time marches on. What did Maureen always say about that again? One day you realize... It's, it's marching, marching across, across your across face. Your face. <laughs> oh, Mo. Some things never change. Uh, you say that like it's a good thing. Didn't she steal that line from somewhere? Didn't anyway? she steal that line from somewhere anyway? Yep. <laughs> it really yeah. is. It really is. Small hey, talk yeah. to it was good to talk, I mean. You know. Yes. Yes, it was. Yeah. It was. I have to get back to it, but see you around, maybe? Sure. I'm sure. See ya. Okay. Right. Now, let's take a picture of this brickwork. Look at that. Look at that brickwork. Let's just frame it right up. There you go. Right, got that. That's good. What if I just walked off? What if the whole point of the game is that you just walk off? You just keep walking?
Oh, 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 that was good. The game was like, no. <laughs> no. The game was like, no, get back in your car. Or maybe that was what was going on in her head. And uh, she was daydreaming in the van. <laughs> Just see the fact that she was playing. What happens if I drive down that bit then? Let's find out. Is the van going to float? Bye. <laughs> Why am I back? Why am I back in the boat? Oh wow. That's good to know. That's good to know, because if I'm one side of the lake and I need to suddenly get to the other side of the lake, I could just drive in the lake and then um, and then I'm done. I don't need to worry about it. <laughs> An officer, she took a photo of the bricks <laughs> and then we went to the lake. Did she... <laughs> she fell in the little... Thing. I think I just found the speed bump skip there. Yeah. I think I did. I've got I've got tears in my eyes on that. I thought it was funny enough when she just like carried on walking straight even though the cliff went down. And then when she went underwater like nothing was happening. That was pretty funny. Down there, in that cornfield. I'm gonna drive through that cornfield in a bit. What's that? Was that a ghost? Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna drive through that cornfield and see if I can see that ghost again. That's happening. All right, we got a few plans in this game now. We got a few plans in it. Let's do it. Uh, let me get the package. Reynolds Farm. That's lighter than I thought. It's lighter than I thought. Okay. Makes a different start. Knock on the door. Hey, up. Hello, sir. I reckon that's a parcel with my name on it. I reckon it is, mate. I reckon your name is Jack Reynolds? Indeed I am. And I reckon you're the new postal worker? Yeah, well, I reckon you could say that. I yeah. reckon you could say that? Well, thank you much. New around here, I reckon. People call me JR. I'm a farmer and DJ. I'm Meredith. Nice to meet you. I reckon you should play some tunes. DJ and farmer, that's a record, though. I think I've heard you on the I radio. I think I've heard you on the radio. You did, eh? Well, it's what I like to do. Mm. I had some spare time and a room in the shed, shit, so I figured, though. why not? About your playlist. I think it could use some more songs. Indeed, indeed. Working on that. But I'm in the middle of a potato harvest. Don't have much time. To hey, buy listen, songs. postal worker Meredith, I need to get back to work. Can you do me a favor and give this envelope to Frank? No, I ain't that much of a stick for the rules. Sure, rooms. no problem. I'm already breaking it. Thank you so much. VHS fucking pyramid skin person. Right, okay. Right, let's get back in the van and try and find this ghost. And we can see whatever the hell we want. She's really interested in the weight of parcel scaring. The thing. Right, let's go. Let's go wreck the crop. Where's this ghost? The ghost is gone. No, there is. What? 
That was moving, right? When we saw it, it was moving. Is that a scarecrow? Don't get your camera out again, what are you doing? That's a terrible shot. <laughs> right, okay, where did he go? Where did the ghost go? There. Here we go. Look, look. He's like listening really carefully for his thing to beat. And then I go right behind and just... Great metal, you found metal. You're not here. You found metal. <laughs> Why am I finding <laughs> Don't change the camera? Let's just let's go to my next thing. Where have I got to go? I've got to go to Frank's and I've got to go over it. Oh, that's not well drive. Can I just Okay. Alright. So we know what to do. The... We gotta deliver that thing right on the other side of the lake. So what's the plan? The plan is to drive into the lake to cut out half of the journey. Bye, mate. Did it work? Yes, it worked. Here you go. Time save. Time save. Is that what they say in some of the games that have gone quick? Can I talk to him? Can I just talk to random people? Can you just talk to random people? It's Campy Nick that. We played this before. Oh, okay. Meredith isn't the best driver. If you're new to the stream, just let you know. Meredith is not the greatest driver. You could talk to him. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. I could have gone. There would have been a great conversation about. What are you doing? I'm looking for metal. Oh really? That sounds like a lot of fun. It is. It's such a small town here. Yes, it is. Can you can you give this uh, bit of metal to Francis? Sure. Think of all that that we just missed out on. Oh, I've got to get a fucking thing out more. Road. Let's roll. This is definitely looks like a drug deal, doesn't it? Hey, Miss W. Got some mail for me today? No, but I have something else. Angie from the Flick Shack asked me to deliver some movie boxes. She also asked me to deliver some to you. Oh, tight. What are the options? Let me see. The Love Bug or A Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh, that last one might be too scary. <laughs> too scary. I'm almost 16, Miss W. I can take a horror movie. That's what I ain't, now that If I... you say so, Lori, I wouldn't want you to get any actual nightmares. I promise I won't get any nightmares. So you'll pick a nightmare on Elm Street? Give mm. me the love bug. Nah, yeah, poor, poor job. I thought you didn't want that one. Ugh, I don't. But if my parents catch me watching Elm Street, they'll ground me for a week. I wish they'd just take a chill pill and see that I'm basically an adult. I fix cars. Yeah, I fix oh, cars. No, that's too bad, Lori. Maybe 15. you can watch it at a friend's house instead. Is that legal? No, I'm homeschooled. 
There aren't many teenagers here, as you may have noticed. So <laughs> that, I don't really have any friends to watch I, it with. <laughs> so it's a love bug for me. I think I'll just keep this one. Well. Well, I'm sure you'll like it too. I'm not you'll get to see a nightmare on Elm Street one day. Watch nightmare on Elm Street so. with me. Thanks, Miss W. Have a nice day. You All do, the Laurie. options for side stuff sound horrible. You return to the post office, you piece of crap. Tell me what to do. Right, should we go and... To... <laughs> should we go and talk to... Um, I tried to enter the car like Grand Theft Auto then. Um, should we go and talk to the, the ghost? What else have I got to do? Nothing. I'm gonna go and talk to the ghost, I think. Can I fast travel? Autopilot, yeah. Let's go and have a look with the ghost. And then we'll finish the day. On a high. It was a ghost, isn't it? Why are you why why are you acting like he's not a ghost guy? Why are you trying to act like he's not a ghost? We saw he was a ghost, didn't we? When we were driving up to the farm. We did we we saw that. No answer. No reply to that, have you? No reply to it. Does anyone actually use these channel points that we put out? How many how many channel points have you lot got? I've got 21 21,000. What can we spend them on? Chat settings. No, that's not what I want. I want... Introducing channel points. Okay, I can highlight my message. Right, okay. I'm gonna highlight a message here from David Turners that says, talk to the ghost, mate. I will, I'll talk to the ghost. You think that was a man, do you? Okay, close-minded. Close-minded people. Oh, where's the ghost? Hey, you need to open up your mind, Gary. Where is he? So he's not here. Not in the ear anymore because he's um, he's gone to the afterlife. Oh, there he is. There's the ghost. What if I park right in front of him? What's he gonna do? Right, you're telling me he's not a ghost, Gary. <laughs> Proof. I'm gonna go and talk to the ghost. <laughs> Michael Jackson. <laughs> talk to me then. You said I could talk to him. Hi oh, there. Okay. Sorry, pardon? Hi there. Oh, hello. I told you it was a ghost. Um, any luck finding any something? Any luck finding something? Yeah, I've, I've found a couple of things. A uh, nail, penny, a soda can. What the empty fuck? Empty soda can. Why is Mackenzie Crook in this? That's Mackenzie Crook, right? What the hell? Hold on. Oh, 
crook like okay it is that's weird Ooh, a penny from what year uh the penny i found is from 1983 so that's worth about one penny that's 99 more and you'll have a full dollar. Well, I mean, fucking hell, you got Mackenzie Crook to come into this. Just there 99 be an more reference. and you'll have a whole dollar. Oh, yes. Metal detecting is a surefire way to become a millionaire. Whoops. Did I just reveal the world's best kept secret? <laughs> <sighs> no worries. Okay. It's safe with me. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to get back to it now. I need to be our MDC later. A metal detectorist club. Nice. A metal detecting club. We compare finds, we discuss the hobby. Sometimes our club president gives a talk on things like buttons. 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 Hmm, could be good. I think I'll wait for the one though. Huge fire. I'll mm. go into this. Could be good. Yeah. Yeah. Well, nice meeting you. It was nice to meet you too. Good luck. Mackenzie Ghost. I love Mackenzie Crook. Right. Is that it? Okay. Metal detector. I've got an achievement for that. Alright, uh, whatever. Let's just go home now. Stop getting your fucking camera out. From the Detectorist show. I don't know that one, Ski Jump Toes. Yeah, that was a cool surprise. Something did finally happen in this game. Um, and judging by the fact that Matt didn't mention it, I bet he didn't know it was in the game. Fast travel here. Fast travel there. I'm tempted to just drive down there and see how far you can get down that road before it says, like, well, I shouldn't be leaving the town. But that'd be a huge waste of everyone's time. So let's go back to the post office. I sh why didn't I just jump in the lake? All right, how do I turn off autopilot? B. All right, okay. We're going straight in the lake, and then we'll and then we'll be home. What's that? Actually, before I do that, let me just because this is actually legit. This is a legit good shot. Don't walk too far out. All right. Look at that. Oh, do I get that? Yeah, I get that in. Look at that, Gary. Look at that. Bam. Tell me that's not a good shot. That is a good shot. Alright, doopy doo. Doopy doopy doo. Do. 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 I am a photographer now. I'm gonna do weddings. Friday evening. Okay. Good day. My name is Walter Morgan. I'm from the Postal Service. Hi. I'm calling with regards to compliance to policies and guidelines, oh, such right. as the use of Postal Service property, code of conduct, and so on. Stop driving in the light. I will be in touch again soon. Beep, beep, beep. Fucking squares. Meredith, it's Steve. What's up, Steve? Thanks so much for improving the text and sending it back to me. I'm confident this will improve our chances of securing a monster deal. You're welcome, Steve. Yeah, I'm it gonna better say help. That. It wasn't the most fun I've ever had. You won't regret it. It's a monster deal. The big retailer, big money, big prizes. A monster deal? That is so awesome! Yeah, big money, big prizes. Knows I need to calm down too. 
Well, yes, calmness is needed. Eyes on the prize. The next South steps are, we're going to meet up yeah, with them this week. Discuss terms. Uh, okay, Steve. Okay, good Steve. Luck. Good luck. Good girl. Thanks, Thanks Meredith. Fun. Speak soon. It's supposed to be another date. I'd be great at weddings. Uh, I watch TV. Who wants to read a fucking book? Boring. Previously on Bon Appetit. Oh, that's right. Good news. Jean Paul has agreed oh, to like. become the chef of the downtown restaurant. Oh, that's fantastic! <laughs> Rock and roll. There is only one problem. Jean Paul is not a cook, but a car technician. Sorry, I don't know why I did that. I think I just. It felt like that's what the character was doing when he was saying. Okay. That's the stream done. Good morning, Meredith. There's an envelope today with an incomplete address on it. It only says Mickey in June, Lake Campground, Providence Oaks. Do you think you can find that? Well. I, yeah, is. I think I know where that is. I've All no right. Idea. Have a great day. Thanks. Oh, by the way, Frank, I wanted to ask you something. I will not babysit Mildred's cats. In the blind, don't worry <laughs> no. about it. It's about something else. Is sports betting legal? What? What's in, What's those, in envelopes? those envelopes for you? Oh, that's just for stamps. Saves them the hassle of driving up here. Hey, I gotta get back to work. Catch you later. Okay. I'm not going to confront him about his gambling addiction. Okay. I'm going to save. And I'm going to unash him. Uh, goodbye.